the first to go would be the gabled roofs and most of the walls would collapse. It, it, would, uh, it would be horrible. For decades, Joe Golden worked as one of the U.S. government's weather czars at NOAA, the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration. Now that he's retired, he's not shy about sharing his own ambitious plan to knock out tornadoes. You need to be able to cool the air relative to the tornado over a large enough area at the right time. Tornadoes form when cold air falling from the top of the storm cloud mixes with the warm updraft rising from the surface. When the colder air finally wraps around the base of the vortex, it cuts off the updraft and kills the tornado. Cold air is the enemy to tornadoes. Cold air impinging on the vortex. And if you can, by some artificial means, reliably and repeatedly cause that to happen sooner than it normally would, you've got a chance at weakening tornadoes.